The ball club getting healthy, a great sign, and Bryce Harper continues to get pitched to, and I think that's a direct reflection of the first two at-bats that Ryan Zimmerman had tonight. Hit the ball in the screws, they had to pitch to Bryce. He made him pay, and guys, that second home run, I'm still going crazy about. I don't know what the official footage is on it, but it's a 500 footer if I ever saw one. It's weird here at Marlins Park the way they mark the distance, but he got all of that one. You can't pure a ball any better. He felt nothing on his bat at all, and he was looking for a fastball right down the middle, and he got it. And for a guy that could never even hit one twice that far, I get excited when I see it. What can I say? It was awesome. <laughs> FP, before I let you go, you had mentioned about Drew Storen and the Papelbon situation. Drew comes on tonight, goes one, two, three in the eighth inning. First time he's been in the eighth all season long. But your comment really caught it hit home because you said that the whole bottom line is to win. Papelbon is here to win. Storen's here to win. That's a great combination to have those two guys back to back in that eighth and ninth inning. Yeah, Ray will tell you it's about 25 guys, not about one. And Drew Storen is one of my favorites. I know we're not supposed to have favorites in this business, but when you're around guys every single day for five years, he's as good as they come. And you feel for him from a personal standpoint, but he's going to get paid and he's going to be a closer and he's going to save a lot of games throughout his career. But right now it's about 25 guys in the ultimate goal, and that's a parade on Pennsylvania Avenue. And they're hoping to have that happen. And if Papelbon can contribute to that, he's a Nat now. And I feel like, you know, we all have to embrace him with open arms and see what he can do. You saw it tonight. It was set up the way Matt Williams wants it. Six inning ball games. Whoever in the seventh, you're thinking it's Casey Jansen right now because he's been so good. And then Drew in the eighth and Papelbon in the ninth. So now all of a sudden, you're, if you're Matt Williams, you're not mixing and matching in the seventh and mixing and matching in the eighth and trying to get to Drew in the ninth. This isn't about Drew Storen or Jonathan Papelbon. It's about the bullpen and hasn't really got the job done as a collective group this year. And Mike Rizzo trying to make them better. And it's about winning baseball games. It's about winning a ring. And I think Drew's smart enough to realize that. Isn't it nice to have you on with us after a win sometimes like yeah. tonight? <laughs> it yeah. is. It it's is nice. nice. Not trying to go spin control and making <laughs> stuff up about how it's going to be better tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Don't forget, right. it starts at noon tomorrow. Don't be late, okay? <laughs> yeah, I'll just be getting in. Thanks, yeah, guys. I bet.